Okay, uh, let me go ahead and give you the answer. In this case, uh, I equals V by R is a uh, linear relationship. And uh, then notice that there's I here and there's V here. Uh, it's a linear relationship. And the slope of the straight line is given by 1 divided by R. Okay, so the resistor is one element, and we have um, innumerable elements in uh, EECS. And another element is a voltage source. A voltage source is an idealistic model of a battery. Uh, again, you can see that uh, there's a voltage V and uh, current I that I define uh, for the element. And uh, the voltage V, the capital V written inside the element, that is the voltage supplied by the uh, element itself for a uh, typical battery. It might be, a uh, say, for example, 1.5 volts. But uh, the properties of the element are described by its uh, VI relation. And so V for this is given by capital V. So notice the small V in this equation here is related to the VI for the element, while capital V, which could be 1.5 volts, is the voltage supplied by the element. Okay, So just make sure to distinguish between what I call uh, variables V and I that describe through an IV relation the element uh, behavior with the element's internal property, such as the resistance or the voltage. Much like we did with the resistor, we can also plot VI relation for the voltage source. And before I show it, let me pause for a couple of seconds so you can think about what it might look like before I give you the answer.